Hi, I'm Bruce Collins. I'm a product manager at Cambium Networks. Uh, at Cambium Networks, we have a, a whole wide variety of point-to-point -point solutions. I wanted to point out a couple of different ones today and give you some trade-offs and benefits of one versus the other so you can kind of understand what uh, is the best way to select the point-to-point uh, -point solution uh, for your specific needs. Uh, so what I have in front of me here is our uh, PTP450i platform. Uh, you can see here this is an uh, integrated solution, so you've got the radio integrated on the back with a, uh, a directional antenna. We have our PTP650. Uh, this is a, shown in a, a connectorized view. You can also get this as integrated with a panel on the front. And then finally, I have our PTP700, which is in a uh, olive drab green, but it's also, you can notice, it's a what we call a connectorized plus integrated. So you've got a directional panel as well as the connectorized. And this is really tailored for our uh, customers in the national government and uh, defense applications. Uh, using the natal band at 4 gigahertz. So let me talk about some of the trade-offs between these radios. Uh, the 450i is quite flexible. It's available in uh, 5 gigahertz, it's available in 900 megahertz, and it's available in the 3.5 and 3.65 licensed and, uh, and light, lightly unlicensed bands. Uh, it's available in um, it does up to about 250 kilobits per second with the new uh, 40 megahertz channels that have just been introduced. Um, and it has a PoE output port, which allows you to connect directly to a, uh, an external video camera, for example, or a Wi-Fi access point. You can provide power using this external port. The PTP650 is the workhorse in the portfolio. This does up to 450 megabits per second. You'll notice it also has uh, external ports for auxiliary devices like Wi-Fi access points and cameras. And we also have a third port on here which is for fiber interfaces. So if I want to deploy uh, optical cables to the radio, I can do that using fiber. Um, this is available in uh, the 5 gigahertz band from 4.9 up to 6.05 gigahertz and really gives us the best spectral efficiency across the, uh, across the spectrum here. And then as I mentioned before, the PTP700 is really tailored to our uh, uh, national defense and security markets. Uh, it's very similar to the 650 but is expanded to include uh, the 4.4 gigahertz up to uh, the 5.9 gigahertz band. So with our PTP portfolio, you need to kind of consider uh, what's the capacity I need, what the band I'm operating in, uh, and what some of the other features I might need like fiber optics or uh, 1588 synchronization, uh, some of those specialized capabilities. So uh, you can learn a lot more about these products over at the uh, community forum at cambiumnetworks.com and we certainly have all the spec sheets and all the details that you can find there. So thanks for joining.